What just happened in Russia? Friday, March 22, 2024, at the Kroko City Hall Concert Hall, located in Moscow. A concert with almost 6,000 people attending at that time. A terrorist group enters and starts to detonate, injuring and attempting to end the lives of everyone present, innocent people, children, women, men, elderly, humans. No, they're not falling from bullets yet. Then set them um, so over for now confirmed. 133 deceased and over 100 injured. The number still increases. 11 people have been detained, including four attackers. The world has come together in relations with Russia, including United States and European powers, with whom Russia is currently in conflict, have sent their support. Russia. After this, the Russian government sent a message that is brutal, saying, death for this promising to make all the guilty pay. One of the suspects said they were going to pay $5,000 to enter and detonate to hurt everyone. He pointed out that he had arrived in Russia on March 4th, coming from Turkey. According to Russian intelligence services, the attack, it was carefully planned. And those involved had made a very specialized plan. Russia, the authors were arrested near the Ukraine border in a Russian province as they were trying to escape to Ukraine. Everyone seems to be uniting against the terror group. Who claims to have done this? Don't ask. Did it, uh, you know this, the president of Russia, Vladimir Putin, has just given the following message. He has said we will punish each one of those who are behind, ensure that each of the culprits will be identified and punished, not rewarded. Very costly rules, murderers of people who have no nationality and cannot have one, await a single and unfortunate fate, revenge and disobedience. The future is uncertain. Today, Russia is in national mourning, and the world wonders what just happened.